Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Leo, April 21, 2022. Topics of conversation, thoughts, and musings can be deeper and more serious than usual early today. You could be fixating on a particular idea or problem or feel pressured to perform. There can be defensiveness in manner or speech that interferes with healthy communication now. Fortunately, it's easier to gain perspective as the day advances. Also today, Mercury moves out of your sign and into your resources sector for a stay until the 29th. You may be putting some of your fresh ideas and enterprises into action or adding the details to plans in the period ahead. Applying new information to business and money ventures can figure strongly. It's also a time for working with your natural talents and putting them to practical use. When stressed, there can be some worry or overstimulation related to money, possessions, and resources. Otherwise, it's one of the best periods of the year for money-making ideas. It would be good for you to stop thinking so much about your emotional needs to start looking for the affection and love that you give to others, Libra will allow you to find that emotional balance between you and the people you love and the right balance between your needs and those of others. Others, remember that to ask you have to give and this sign will help you to do so. You are a very sensitive person and sometimes it can seem like you don't care about anything or anyone other than yourself. This is not true, you just need to learn how to express what you feel healthy. You may want to talk to someone about your feelings or even write down some things that you think about when you are alone. Stop constantly wanting to fight your spouse's flaws, it will get you nowhere and will only upset you a little more. You could also show some clumsiness yourself today, unimportant of course, but which could seriously annoy your spouse. So turn your tongue well before shouting and avoid words launched in a hurry. Single, you will have to accept not to fall on the perfect person the first time. It would be good to look for ways to improve your relationships with friends and family. If you are feeling lonely, you might want to reach out to someone else or join a group of people who share similar interests. Right now you feel like you need to have a clone. Perhaps you are so busy that you don't even have time to sleep at night. Now try not to overschedule activities and responsibilities. Leave space for rest. If you demand so much from your body, you can get sick. To avoid this, you'll want to employ a more moderate approach. Does the topic of finance stress you out? Mercury the messenger enters Taurus today, bringing clarity and momentum to your second house of comfort, finances, and value systems, which means you're prone to being more preoccupied with themes surrounding your sense of security. Luna's shift into Sagittarius and your romantic fifth house of passion and pleasure is usually a plus, as it highlights everything from a particular love interest to your heart's desires. Luna, however, will meet with the wounded healer, Chiron, which, in turn, challenges you to reflect on your individual freedom. Your words have power. As a strong, confident fire sign, you tend to show up with gumption in your workplace. But since Mercury in your sign squares Pluto in Capricorn today, you may want to think before speaking. Tone, turf, and timing will be crucial in your professional dialogue today. Later on, Mercury will leave your sign for the graceful Taurus, switching your tone from assertive to steady. Your mind will become less preoccupied with your professionalism and more focused on your financial endeavors. While Mercury is in Taurus, you should consider new ways to budget or make money. In the lead-up to Mercury's return to your income sector tomorrow, for one more day the focus is on the big picture, making it important to keep your mind and your options open. Mercury's return tomorrow will give you the smart head for money needed to get your head in the game, start thinking on your feet and get the most active months of the year on the income front moving. Don't hesitate to let people into your far-reaching plans. They will be curious and interested in hearing about your ideas, giving you some useful advice at the same time. Take criticism seriously. This will help you to become more aware of your weaknesses and to make progress with your previous plans, improving your chances of success. Sit down and listen up. A million mixed messages are coming your way, but only one of them is meant for you alone. 
Pick it out and you'll learn what you need to do next to get some good attention. You're likely to experience a surprise, especially where love and romance are concerned. Don't be afraid of any new experience, as long as you don't become tongue-tied when you are first introduced to the person of your dreams instead appreciate the unforgettable feelings you experience at this memorable time. Your spiritual nature is enlivened by today's transit. We humans have a special relationship with water. It gives us spiritual rejuvenation and makes us feel alive. You may want to think about how much water you actually give yourself each day. Water plays a vital role in how your skin looks, and whether or not you have regular digestive activity. Eight full glasses a day will dramatically change how you look and feel. Take care that you are not overly demanding or bossy on this day of your own essence. With the added injection of your need for independence and leadership strengths, you may be in a rigid mindset one that sees you wanting to have complete control over everything. Further, others who have ideas that interfere with yours may not be as well received as they should. Be patient and respectful, even if this means biting your tongue at times. Our eyes in the sky. The north node of destiny in Taurus aligns with Uranus, which is strong in Pisces today. When these earthy elements link up, it pushes us to take practical and concise action toward achieving our goals. The caveat is that Mars is also activating the south node of destiny, which could make us a little temperamental and frustrated. However, Mars in Pisces gives us the strength to make sure that all the projects on the back burner get finished today. Completing them allows us to succeed in the field in which we work, study, or otherwise devote our energy. Venus in Pisces harmonizes with the nodes of destiny on the Taurus-Pisces axis. When these celestial entities softly connect, it can expand our hearts and give us a lot of energy to partner up with people. Relationships can deepen at this time. If you're feeling generous, now is the time to give freely to manifest goodness in your life. If you need assistance, this is a wonderful day to seek kindness from others. What they offer could surprise you. The same applies to personal relationships. The need to have faith in and trust your friends, family, and partner can keep you from seeing the truth. On the other hand, you could see flaws you've ignored up to now. The cosmic energy is very dense, which is why it would be best to rest and retreat instead of try to connect with people. Watch a movie and take a nap instead of falling down the rabbit hole of paranoia. In the morning, the Sagittarius moon sextiles Chiron in Aries, encouraging us to find community in common ground amidst pain. Insecurities concerning our identity and individuality can run deep, often tracing their roots to our childhoods when we were just beginning to develop self-awareness. Hurt feels personal, so much so that we routinely convince ourselves that no one else could possibly understand us. Yet, at this time, a lack of interest in dwelling on the past enables us to discuss our anxieties openly. Pain is not an exclusive commodity, and by bearing witness, we help one another heal. Following this, the moon squares off with Uranus in Taurus, provoking surprise events or rash behavior. Upsets occur which impact our relationships and interrupt routines. Technological errors or a sudden loss of resources can derail our plans. While charting a course and then having to reverse direction is frustrating, a lack of patience can thwart the very opportunities we hope to position ourselves for. Pause, take a breath, and let the dust settle before trying to force a new agenda.